Hello, in this video we are going to be making clay sculptures. Go ahead and gather all the supplies that are on the screen. First, choose the color of clay that you want for the body or the base of your sculpture. Warm the clay by kneading it with your fingers. Once your clay is warmed up, start making your base. For my base, I rolled my clay in my palms to make a ball. Once the ball was formed, I pushed my thumb in the middle of it to make a dent. I pinch the walls of the dent over and over to make bigger walls. This technique is called a pinch pot. I take another piece of clay and form it into a sausage shape. I then place it on the table and move it back and forth with my fingertips and palm. This is called a coil. Once I have my coils placed on my base, I pat them down so that they stay. I wanted to add texture to my sculpture. I use the arms of my fork to scratch the surface of the clay. To make my sculpture more proportionate, I added a head on top of the coils. I also added a coil to the bottom to make my sculpture taller. I gently rub my clay with my fingertip to smooth out any seams or dents. To get a different color of clay, I mix my blue and green clay to get a new color of green. I roll it out into a ball and flatten it out with my palm. I place two popsicle sticks on the sides of the clay and start rolling it out with a glass bottle. This creates a slab. I take my plastic knife and cut out some triangles. I place my triangles onto my sculpture, making sure to gently pinch the clay so that my shapes stick. I make a new shape by rolling balls of clay into a seed shape. I place the new shape onto my sculpture to create a pattern. I roll more coils and cut them into equal lengths. I roll them again and place them on top of my sculpture to create a hair. I add texture with my fork. For the eyes, I use small balls of clay. I also use a small coil for the mouth. I pause to see if I need any more texture, make the sculpture more proportionate, or if the sculpture needs to be balanced. I decided that I needed to add arms. I added another coil to make it taller.
add in more detail like feet and texture. I asked myself if there's anything else I could add to my sculpture, such as balance or texture. 